Hello everyone. My name is Sachin Kashyap. Welcome back to the Kashyap Tech. So, this is the tutorial about the connection managers in SSIS packages. So, let's start with the first one. That is the connection managers. What type of connection managers uh, are in the SSIS package? So, the SSIS connection manager primary purpose is to provide the connections within package that can reuse in other package or task. If it is package specific, you can use it all the task that belong to that package. If it is project specific, you can use it in all package within that projects and supported SSIS connection manager. So there is a two types of con uh, connection managers in uh, SSIS package that is project level and a package level connection managers. So for the project level connection manager, if you configure the project level connection manager, the connection connection is available to all the package we created under the under the, that projects when you upgrade the projects to the current version the project level connection manager will work without any issues if you need that connection in multiple package creating a project level connection manager in SSIS good practice in real time we mostly use project level connection man manager but there are some situation where we use the package level connection manager as well if you see we have a lot of uh, connection managers options and lists in the SSS package like you can see ADO, ADO.NET, CAS, uh, file, excel these are the common connections we mostly people are using like OLEDB, ODBCs, SMTPs like that and we have the description as well okay so let's start with the example uh, by going to the SSS package SSS visual studios so if you see in the right side we have the solution explorer Okay, whenever you create any projects under the Visual Studio, then you will see this Solution Explorer where we have the Connection Manager options. Uh, click on the right, right click on this one and New Connection Managers. You will see one new window open that is Add SSS Connection Manager. You will see many Connection Manager types we have. Okay, so we have the description as well for this one. So let's try with the OLEDB Connection Managers. So let's add okay so these are the already i have created in my uh, visual studio in ssas package connection so that's why it's showing here but if you want it if you you can create a new projects and then you can uh, follow these steps you will not going to see this here okay so just click on the new one okay click ok and you have to select the providers like i will select oled data provider 19 okay and i have the uh, my connections of databases okay so I'll put here and then uh, if you see I'll see the databases okay so just you have to select the database name and, and click on click on the ok then you will see here we have the connection previously it was two connection was there but now it's a here uh, three connection so just click on the ok uh, while means uh, you will click uh, on the ok then you will see the connection was here uh, created now this can be used anywhere uh, in the in the project level okay so this will be very easy uh, to configure the connections for the project level so let's see the second one that is uh, you know uh, package level connection so if you configure package level connection manager the connection will be available to that particular package you can't access it outside the package okay so if like we have if you need that connection in one package and don't use it another another there is a no point in creating project level connection manager so go for the package level connection manager so basically like uh, we have the many situation in that like uh, uh, in the scenario we, we are creating the packages and every package have the different connections like different database so we are creating the connection in a as a like a package level but suppose in in any scenario the data source or any connection it's same for the all the package whatever we are going to configure then you can uh, choose the package sorry project level con con uh, connection manager okay so let's see the package level as well uh, so you see this is the blank window uh, blank space here in the control flow just right click and you see the new connection here when you click on the this then you will see same window 
to add this and follow the same steps to add uh, like uh, I'll select OLEDB click on OK then you can see last time we have created this one now click on the new one then you will see you have to choose the OLED, OLEDB you know native OLEDB providers whatever providers you have you can select and configure the connections okay so it's a package level connection means let's let's I'll create uh, one for uh, you know for the package level let me create it so just select this one just put the uh, and I'll select testing click OK then see the testing database if you see this one have been created for the package level you can see here it's a uh, the connection was showing here in the connection manager list but not here okay so it's a project level and it's a package level so this connection you will be going to use for this package only the package name is like a for, for each loop not uh, other package which are uh, having in these projects okay so that's it thank you and uh, please subscribe and share the uh, channel to others thank you thank you so much